Hello fellas, how are you doing? In this lesson we are going to practice um, again phrasal verbs but the other time we were working with uh, the, of course you know that a phrasal verb has two parts a verb part and a key part so we were uh, learning uh, the key verb key verbs in, in that case was come, right? the verb come but in this case we are going to use key particles we are going to be with, begin with of as you know I, I am using the information of this book called English Phrasal Verbs in Use uh, of Cambridge uh, it was written by Michael McCarty and Felicity Odo so we are going to start uh, so we have the key particles with of for example uh, we can use lift of, head of, send of, sleep of, and clear of. Living places, because of uh, means to not be somewhere, right? Uh, let's check the meaning of of alone first. What does of means, man? It, it's a it's an adverb, and it's away from. So be being away from something somewhere right a b1 uh, adverb it says away from a place or position especially the present place position or time so be really away from somewhere right uh, i don't know maybe i am off my house i am off the park examples he drove off at the most incredible speed keep the dog on the lead or he'll just run off someone ran off with uh, my pen she's off to Canada next week or I saw her off at the station that yeah we're going to to see that uh, see off right later okay as I was telling you guys we have lift off head off send off slip off and clear off for example, the space shuttle will lift off at 9 hours. The meaning is lift the ground or, or as of a spacecraft or aircraft. Uh, so basically in this example, the space shuttle will lift off. It, it, it just means to lift the ground so it, it will begin to move towards the, the upper part of the earth uh, towards the space. So that's the meaning of lift off. In Spanish is despegar. Yeah, that, that's it, lift off. Second, we should head off about at about 6 tomorrow. Uh, it, it sounds to me like uh, we should like go, right? Uh, yeah, and the meaning is to start a journey or leave a place. So we should head off at about 6 tomorrow. We should um, go at about 6 tomorrow. So start going, right? Start a journey or leave a place. Third, I've sent off that letter you wrote to the newspaper. Send a letter, document, or parcel by post. Fourth, let's try and slip off before the meeting finishes and go for a drink. What does slip off mean? Leave a place quietly so that other people do not notice you going. Yeah, that, that's the meaning. I, I, I remember that I was practicing it today. So basically lift, lift off is, that's the meaning as it says to just leave a place but uh, making sure other people don't notice you going so it's like you go quietly uh, without making any noise right and the last one is why did he jo just clear off without saying goodbye clear off this is a private property clear off as it means leave a place quickly and it's informal, clear off. So, a slip off and clear off are kind of the same, but whereas a slip off refers to a uh, leave a place without other, other people not noticing you, clear off, uh, uh, it, it's not like a commandment that you have that other people don't have to notice you. B, ending or changing state. Off sometimes expresses the idea of moving towards an ending or a change of state. I'll come and see you off at the airport tomorrow. See you off. See you off. Like see you like away from you. Well, in this case means see you off means to see off someone. 
to go to the airport in order to say goodbye. So for example, uh, I have a cousin and he lives in the US and sometimes he comes here to Peru. And I, I could say, uh, you know what, Alexander, um, uh, you're going to leave Peru, so uh, I'll be busy working and uh, I'm going to see you off at the airport because you're leaving. Or maybe, I don't know, my, my, my mother uh, is going to, uh, to work it's going to work and uh, uh, I tell you I'll tell my mother uh, see you off because uh, I am with her and she's going to work a second example my cousin has sold off his share of the internet company he started with a friend sold off means sold all your part all, all or, or part of a business sold off right sold off so, sold something off next after lunch grandpa dosed off on the sofa Dosed off means the brother started to sleep, especially during the day. So like taking a nap, right? Like you're really tired and you just dosed off. Next, Mr. Prosser suddenly looked very pale and broke off in the middle of his lecture. What does broke off mean? Suddenly stop speaking. Uh, this happened to me when I was 14 years old. I remember that I, I was exposing something in, in history class. And then I like felt uh, really in, like I felt insecurity, and I didn't remember that topic so well that I broke off. Yeah, because uh, I, I suddenly stopped speaking. Yeah, it was shameful, right? Next, she's so clever she can run off a thousand word essay in an hour. It takes me all day. So run off means to quickly and easily write something that is usually difficult to write. So for ex example, I can run off uh, poems, uh, a lot of poems in just one hour. A and the last one, note that run off with the meaning of leave somewhere quickly could also have been included in A above. Okay. C, other expressions with off. What he said has put me off the idea of going to bland while for a holiday all together. Put off, in the yeah, I I I as I told you, put off means that means to postpone something so for example put off the meeting but in this case that's not the, the meaning of put off so in this case put off means to make me not like something like uh, we were going to the park but what michael said has put me off like not not like doing it right okay next one his description of the hotel was very off-putting uh, made something someone attractive and pleasant from the verb put off uh, for example, uh, I don't know. His description of of, of the girl is of pudding. Like uh, we thought that the the girl was was beautiful, but he ended up talking shit about her. So uh, his talking of her was of pudding, right? Next, maybe we should hold off and go to Paris or somewhere in the spring. Hold off means to delay doing something. Next. I think I've managed to turn him off the idea of building a model railway track in the back garden. Turn off, make someone decide that they are not interested in something, right? And last one, she didn't get offended by the comic, she just la laughed it off. Laugh about something unpleasant in order to make it seem less important or serious. Okay guys, uh, this has been the lesson of today, I hope you like it, thank you, rate and subscribe, goodbye.